morning everybody, Alex here from Snake on Exotics. Today we've got some customer deliveries. So we've had some stuff delivered, ready for the customers to come and collect it for their animals and stuff like that today. So we've got quite a bit going on, so please like, subscribe, comment and share, ring the bell for me. We've got Morgan coming in in a sec, she's a little bit early today, a little bit early, a little bit keen. So I'll beat Morgan today. So uh, please like, subscribe, comment and share, ring the bell for me and we'll crack on with our jobs for today. So first, we're going to have a look at this nice tank. So. This is the Zoomed uh, 30 by 30 by 45. It's got one door and they've changed the back panel. It used to be a, a, um, a polystyrene uh, fake background. Now it's a proper cork background, like I did on my big display one. So that's really, really good. I like that. I like that they've gone for the natural one now. Um, yeah, free natural cork background. See, new addition to it, new addition. So I really like that. So that's really, really good. It's gonna be nice for the frogs, nice for the customer. So that's really, really good, ready to go. Uh, we'll open the boxes next and see what we've got in the boxes. What time do you call this? <laughs> I'm only playing you up. I found a pen knife. Let's see if it's any good. Can we, can we... Come on, it's not the best. It's not the best, but it will do. It will do the job, sort of. Come on. Come on. Do it. Oh, this is... Come on, can we just rip this off? Yes, we can. Okay, what's we got in the box? Firmostat, lovely job, nice firmostat, ready to go. See what we got in this one? We are expecting another little delivery. I'm expecting a light to come so I can build a full enclosure because I believe Lumpy Bumpy's going to his forever home today. So we'll see what happens. That is the plan that Lumpy Bumpy goes to his forever home today. Oh, come on, we can do it. Ah, oh. come on, come on, we can do it. Whoop, 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 whoop. Oh, sand mats. So we got all different sizes of sand mat. We got the mediums. We've got a large, a small, and a medium. So I'm back. We had to pop into town. So. Uh, but I come back bearing gifts. So we come back bearing gifts. So we've got Greg's. So I bought, bought a look at a sausage roll. Sausage roll. So we're doing really, really well. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna be, uh, I've got to build a tank. Morgan's doing all her jobs. Uh, I am waiting for a little bit of equipment to come. Uh, so I'm gonna be a bit ooh, waiting for that to come. But as soon as it comes, we'll set it all up. And we'll be raring to go. <laughs> so if you remember, last week we gave the Patman frog his first ever full pinky. <laughs> He's so fat. It's amazing. What are you doing, little dude? Why you look how tubby he is? He's so tubby. Can we come round? You're yeah, more body and legs, mate. You put so much timber on. Look at the size here. He's all big and fat. Oh, I'm happy with that. You're a big fat froggy. Yes, you are. You're a big fat froggy. Morgan's doing your water bowl, and then you can go have a swim. So we're checking the frogs, seeing if they've ate the food we put in for them yesterday. So we put three locusts in here yesterday for our froggos, and I can't see any, not one locust in there. So that's a good sign that they've ate them. What about the big ones? Because we put quite a few in the big ones tank. Uh, no locusts. No locusts, so I'm happy with that. Looks like they've had a nighttime feed and ate all the locusts. So I'm happy with that. That's very, very good. Sometimes when it's holiday animals, they don't settle in quite well because they don't know they're missing their home, they're missing their tank, they're missing their owners. So uh, sometimes they need to take a while to settle in. So hand feeding and tweezer feeding sometimes is a little bit hard for them to do. So even if they don't, we put the food in there and then we count it and make sure in the morning. If it's gone, happy days, that means they fed because they don't just vanish. <laughs> so 
Hey guys. So at least we know those frogs have fed last night for us. So while we wait for the part I need to build this enclosure, um, Morgan's doing some jobs over here, but once she's finished, I'm gonna go up and clean all the glass. So as you can see, he destroys his glass virtually every day. So you have to give it a good clean. And then somehow, I don't know how the black spotted tailed iguana, I think he's pooed or weed all up the glass. So he's done it, he done it the other day and he's done it again. So I don't know how he's done it, but yeah, so I'm gonna clean all that today. So that'll be nice and fun for us to do. So Alex, how do we clean glass? Well, well, you see, it's quite simple. So what we <laughs> So what we do is we we use RO water. So RO water doesn't have any of the calcium or anything like that in there, it just, it's just pure water. So if we use normal water, there's a good chance it can leave lime scale on the glass, which is the little white marks, which we don't want. So RO water doesn't have any of that. You've pooed in here again. You've pooed in here again. Go to his water bowl as well, because state of it. So what we do is we spray the glass with the RO water. We give it a good spray, give it a wash down, get quite a lot of the bits off straight away. So, lovely job. Then we just get a nice bit of kitchen towel, so we don't use any soap, we don't use anything like that. We just use a bit of water and a bit of tissue, and a bit of elbow grease. So we fold all this up, it would be a, a folded up better than normally. And we just start at the top, Ooh, and work our way down. It can be a bit of a pain because obviously there's two panes of glass and uh, it can be a bit awkward. So what we do is we do one half, get it nice and clean, and then we slide it back and forth and then we'll be able to do the one side and the other. So uh, I'll slide this one all the way that way and then we pull this one this way and we can clean that side. And then I'll do, then I'll go over to this side, clean this bit, and then I'll do the same back and forth. So that's how we clean all the sides of the, the glass. Because it can be hard because this, the bit that overlaps can be hard to clean. So uh, we do the same again. I can't because it's been stolen. It's been stolen. Morgan! Morgan! Sorry. <laughs> Morgan! <laughs> so there we go. <laughs> Spray this panel and then uh, tissue again and we give it a wipe out. Lovely, lovely. Ooh. So I'm gonna have to go back and forth and do the other side as well. That gives you an idea of how we clean the glass and get rid of all the lime scale and any marks like that. So that's what I'll do. I'm gonna do the next one. Well, I'll show you when I do that one, just in case the animals do anything cool. There he is. Look at the belly on him. So I'll carry on cleaning the glass and we we'll, shall be back. Okay then, buddy, your glass is clean. Would you like a spray? You want a spray? Oh, he loves a spray. Don't you, sir? Oh, look at that. There we go. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. He likes to spray because he's semi-aquatic lizard. He likes to, he likes to have a swims. He likes having a bath. Oh, look at that. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. So there we go, nice clean lizard and a nice clean container. So there we go, that's a lot better. We can actually see him now. So I'm gonna do his water bowl and we'll put some veg in for him and then that's him done for today. Well, hey, it's only took him a month but, da, 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 plant box, we got plants, we got f fishy plants. So it's took them absolutely ages. So first we had a problem with payments because they didn't have a card machine, I don't do checks. Uh, Cause I'm not a hundred years old. <laughs> and then they, I did, a, did an order. They then lost, then the order was, it was meant to be on the delivery day, it was in Holland. So it wasn't going to arrive that day. So they had to redo it all. And they've sent me another big box, but they did it at half price for me to say sorry. So we've got a load of plants. 
so we can open up the plant box, see what Alex has ordered. I've got some nice stuff, I think, fingers crossed. So we're opening it up, we can finally get to use the plant tank again, so we can fill the plant tank back up, turn the lights on, and we'll be ready to go. We got plants, Morgan. Oh, what's the camera doing? Oh, here we go. We got plants, Morgan. Lovely, lovely plants. Oh, we like some. Okay. Oh, okie dokie then. Wow, this is different. This is rather different. Everything's all in packets. Okay, this is new. Okay. Ooh! Oh, yes! Oh, we've got a bunch today, so we can start opening them. Where's my knife? I've lost my knife. Oh, we're in, we're in. It's okay. We don't need the knife. Oh, well, we might do. We might. Oh, no, we've done it. We've done it. There we go. So, this has got quite a lot of plants. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. Uh, definitely more than I ordered. This is definitely more than I ordered. I think they've sent me these as a, as a thank you, or as an apology. That's really cool. Plants all in packets. So we're going to start. We'll get all the ones that are going to be in the packs. So everything that's over there can stay there. That's going in. They're going in. These will be going in, and these ones, whoop, oh, Morgan's foot, and those ones. These ones are going to be slightly different, kind of a, oh, there's two boxes, two packs of that. Oh, we've got loads, we've got loads. So these are all the really, really nice uh, bottom plants and um, like aquascaping plants. So they're really, really good. Um, so let's start putting some stuff into there, then we can start opening everything else. Here we go, I've got loads of plants all dished out into a box, all un unbagged. So we're just gonna put them all into here now, and then we can carry, we've got even more to open. I've worked out that I ordered these, I ordered them, those are freebies. So uh, that's an apology for the messing up they've been doing. So uh, what we're gonna do now, we're gonna grab a bunch and then drop them in. And we're just gonna let them settle out for a bit and then we'll distribute them out and, and separate them out afterwards. Because we want them to untangle themselves because we don't want to damage them. Um, that's the same plant, so that can go in there as well. Then we've got our, these are some of the oxygenators. So, they do make a slight difference, but don't be expecting them to, to take the replace of an air stone because they won't. Um, the amount of oxygen they put out is actually minute. So uh, they do do a bit, but it's not fantastic. Um, so we're gonna have to go to the other side, I think, and put some of these over there. Oh, we, we got, oh no, we got the middle section. Well, ha ha, so we've got all our oxygenator ones on his side, and then we can put our fancy ones on the other side. So we've still got our uh, avatar stone. So the idea is that sticks to the glass. And you can put plants on it at different heights. How cool is that? Oh, Morgan's come prepared. Look at that brownie point. Oh, lovely job. Wow. So with some of the plants that we've got today, we might be able to set this up with some plants and make it look cool, but we'll see how we get on. Let's have a look at the freebies first and then we can go through our box of stuff afterwards. Let's look at the three bits. And Morgan's using the bench, so we won't use the bench. We're gonna go over to the till area and watch it, because there's a lot of sun over here and the camera doesn't like the sun. It's, been, it's doing good though, considering. I have had a uh, protective screen put on the camera, so uh, I'm hoping it hasn't made any difference, but you'll be able to, the first clips today didn't have the screen on. The second and third clips had the screen on, I think. So uh, you would be able to see the difference. Let me know if that's made a difference or not, or if it's still exactly the same. So in here, whoop, are all our freebies. Keep in mind, we're on the floor because we can actually see what we're doing. Oh, can we open it? Can we open it? Can we open it? Can we? No, maybe? Ah! Yes, we're in. I put an hole in it. I put an hole in it. Rip it open. Come on. 
How can I lose against a piece of plastic? <laughs> so let's have a look. So we've got oh some lovely little plants, some grasses, some oxygenators, more oxygenators. Oh, that's a plant, bunch of plants we can put in with everybody else. Oh, I, I like these, but how long would they last in here? That is my question. So I've never had these in the packets before. But there might be a better way. Because then we don't have to have a plant tank if all the plants are in bags. I think well, there's a reasonable amount as well. They've actually given me loads. And more, and more. And it's still coming, still coming. Ooh. More grasses. Oh, I like these. Very, very nice. So, there we go. There's all my freebies. Now, how do we display and sell these? Oh, I know what we do. There we go. There's all our hanging plants. So, I'm going to let you know how they get on. I think they're going to do really well, though. I think they're really, it's a really good idea, I think. We've got all our plants in the, in the tank doing well. And then down here, we've got these to sort out now. So, we've got to get these out of the box. No. Come on, box. Out of the box, box. Come on. Okay, we got it. Oop, we got it. I'm coming. Come in, Morgan. Come in. Ooh, okay, so what we're going to do, we're going to put them all on this shelf. Is the idea. Ooh, so we've got to open it up. It's going to make me look bad again, isn't it? It's going to make me look bad again. Yeah, we need something to open it. Cha cha! Lovely, 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 lovely. So, in here we've got, I believe, about 20 different ones. So they should all be in nice little pots. Look at that. All ready to go. Lovely, jubbly. So they're all going to be on here like this. Ready to go. Okay, so I've had to moan at them again. So I've opened all these boxes and they're all a bit damp and deformed and stuff. So I rang him up and he said, you can have 50% off. I said, you've already given me 50% off. That means it's free now. And he went, yeah, it does. So we get everything for free. So that'll teach them, will it? You've got to send me good stuff. So it was half price because they didn't send it to me and it's half price again because it's damaged. So uh, we're still through all that. I'm gonna have to dry all the boxes off and stuff like that. But uh, we've got some lovely, lovely little plants. We've got some lovely moss. The moss is absolutely stunning. But we we'll soon dry out the boxes, it's fine. But uh, we've got loads and loads of different stuff. So I'm going to put it all out on there and then we can have a look. Oh my lord. You can't see it. Can you see? Can we see? It's the blooming fish fans here. Giant K's here with all, all the fishy stuff. All the tanks and everything. It's, it's a mass. It's on a pallet. It's huge. They told me it was coming tomorrow. Oh, okay. So we've got to jump on and do this now. So. I've laid all them out, I haven't finished yet. But look how nice that looks. So uh, they're really, really nice. I've got to label them all up and price them all up. But I've got to go do this now. We've got a whole pallet for the fish tanks and bits and bobs. So we've got to start putting them all in the shop. So we have to unravel it all, get it all in the shop, label it all up, price it all up, and then crack on. So all our plans have virtually gone out the window today with all the deliveries because they didn't tell me when it was coming and they told me it was tomorrow. So I wasn't expecting any of this 
So, but that looks really cool. I think that looks really nice. Got our lovely range of nice little carpeting plants and grasses and mosses. Really, really good. So I'm happy with all them. We've got a very large, this is every single type they do. So I've bought, I've had a sample of every single one they do. So we can see which ones do the best, which ones everyone likes the most. I like the mosses. There are some really, really nice mosses in there. But now we've got to open all this. So we've got all this to open up now. We've got all our goodies. So whatever, I'm going to open them. I've got to label the tanks and put them on shelves and sort them all out. Um, and then we've got to open this box. And that box is really, really heavy. So I'm assuming that's full of rocks. Oh, and we have this as well. How cool is that? This is nice wood already on a nice piece of slate for you. So all you've got to do is plonk it in. It's going to sit up right like this. It's not going to move. It's not going to fall over. And it looks really cool. So I've got to watch how I put it because I put it like that before. And I can see somebody taking their eye out. So we don't want that. So I'm going to have to turn it like this. Perfect. So whoop, there we go. I didn't hit my head. Perfect. So we're having technical difficulties. We haven't got a clue where we're going to put any of that at all not a sausage no idea at all because well see if you can spot a spot for us to put any of this can you spot anywhere anywhere with room anywhere I can't spot anywhere <laughs> so yeah I'm gonna have to I might have to move some stuff around uh, Oh, we're gonna have to have a check and sort stuff out, I think. So me and Morgan are officially the Tetris champions. Because we fitted everything in and we had no space. So we are the Tetris champions. And don't you wouldn't beat us. Wouldn't beat us. So we've got all them in there, look at that. Whoa ha ha! Don't that look snazzy? Whoa. We've got the big tank down the bottom, we managed to squeeze it in. And then we got all them ones up there. Which is really good. So Managed to move some stuff around and find extra spaces. Um, still, got to find that one in the space, but I'm hoping the customer's going to come and collect it. Um, we've still got to open these boxes. So next job, open the boxes, see what Alex has ordered. Wahaha. And if I've got space to put it in the shop. We've got special, special today. Morgan's opening the box for you. Look at that. We've got a lady's touch. Look at that. She does it a lot easier than me. Look at that, she's got two hands, it's easier, she's got the advantage. Oh, Dragon Rock. Oh, look at that. Look at some nice pieces. Oh, that's huge. Oh my God. That is huge. Look at the size of it. Oh my Lord. Look at that, so we've got to distribute all that into that little slot right there. Then we can open this bad boy. So I think I've got an idea of what's in here now, so I remember what I've done the order. So if you remember, I was telling you that we're completely changing how we do the filtration on our tanks. And I believe this is all of it arriving. Wow. So we should have a load. Oh no, still haven't done it, still haven't done it. Should be loads of them in here. Yep, absolutely loads. Absolutely loads. So these are all our new little filters. I think I've ordered a slightly wrong size. I thought these were the 80 litre ones. Mmm. It's all in Chinese. Yeah, I'm thinking, I, I, I thought the 80, I thought 80 litres. Um, uh, I'm going to have to see if they're big enough. Yes. Suitable for tanks below 80 litres. Fine, that's perfect. Absolutely perfect. Because a lot of our tanks, if we go over here. So, 80 litres is that big tank down there. Absolutely huge. So, we'd say... These ones are probably close to between 80 and 100 litres. 
these are all below 80 liters all of them so these are what all these filters are going into and they'll be really really good ah yes i'm right so these are the big ones for the big hundreds to 80 plus tanks so uh okay we're gonna have to start we'll get we we'll get a load of the we'll get all the heaters out the bubblers out and then we'll get to the next lot of stuff the sponge filters are out so we've got some lovely cichlid food cichlid gold hayaka 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 would you hayaka Hikari. Hikari, okay. <laughs> I'm not, it's not my fault. I'm not, it's not my fault. Um, we've got some airline because they don't have the big ones. So we had to buy little stuff. Oh, what's this? What is this? Oh, it's the shop anti fungus and white spot. Ooh. Big, big supply of that. Uh, We've got some marine S food. Oh, lovely, lovely. I think that's for me. Oh, we've got some more. We've got more. Uh, we've got some nice little tanks. Very nice. We've got tortoise. No, turtle food. My mistake, turtle food. We've got anti-parasite. We've got anti-white spot and fungus. We've got even bigger turtle food. We've got thermometers. We've got shedding aid, which is really good. Helps all the animals out. And then we've got two mystery boxes. So we've got a box there to open and a box there to open. I'm afraid that's all we've got of Morgan today. She's got to go. She's got to go to her second job. They've called her in. So uh, she's going to go that and we're going to finish off the day without her, I'm afraid. But we've got most of the stuff out of there now. So we're just about to open these boxes. And then I'm probably going to start our job over here is so you can see we've got all our filters all laid out so once i've done that i'll tell you what we're gonna have to do where curiosity has got the better of her and she wants to see what i've got in these boxes before she goes so i said that's fair enough that's fair enough i would want to see as well so oh it's tissue okay i'm gonna hold this was it stuck in there is it this might be hard to get out yeah, I might have to, we might have to cut the box because it's all rammed in. Ah, so we've opened the box a bit more, so I should be able to just pull it out. Well, yes. Proper job, Morgan. Proper job. So now we take all this off here and we should have a lovely little bonsai tree. Whee! That's a bit naff, in my opinion. So... Compare that, that lovely dun tree, to that monstrosity. So you've got lovely tree, lovely tree, absolutely stunning, really, really well made. What the hell do you call that? That look at it. It is really bad. That is really, really bad. We shall be moaning about that. We shall be moaning. Oh, oh, put it, pull, do the magic pull, Morgan. Oh, oh, what have we got? Magic pull. Whoosh. Oh, oh, we got a skull, Morgan. Look that at it. So cool. How cool is that? We got a loggy skull. Very nice. It's Groot. We've got Groot. Oh. How thou shall be on a summer's day. Oh, what does he, what's he say? I don't know. He says something, the bloke says something when he's got a skull in his hand. Alas, oh Warwick, we knew him well. I think that's what he says. I'm not sure, but I think that's what he says. But look how cool that is. Whoa. I'm pretty sure I'm going to run out of time today. We're not going to have time to do this. And I'm building the tank now for the customer. So we're probably, we have the saying goodbye to um, Lumpy Bumpy but then I think that'll be today's video and then what I'll do is I might make another video of doing all the filters and doing the axolotls and stuff like that so that might be another one for you tonight uh, but see how I do I'm actually a little bit sad that Lumpy Bumpy's going he's been here that long now that I've kind of got a little bit of attached to him I've got a soft, stop, yeah, soft spot for him I have so what I've been doing is like when I've got multiple in there I sell off the other ones and I've just been keeping Lumpy Bumpy back because I've got a soft spot for him. Oh, but I found him a really, really good home. I think they're really, really going to look after him. He's got a nice big enclosure to go into now. 
that's going to be his new big enclosure so he can have a nice area to go in. Um, it's just, I get attached to him too much sometimes. But, so we're going to catch him up, put him in his tub, and he's going to go to his forever home. Okay, Bumps, where am you, buddy? He's at the back over here. Come on, Bumps. Here he is. Hello, Lumpy. What are you doing, buddy? Hey? What you doing? Got loads of veg for you. Do you want to have a munch before you go? You can have a munch before, or we can put some in there with you. How does that sound? Would you like to have some in there with you? You don't look very impressed. <laughs> Come on, should we put you, we put you a bit of tomato. A bit of tomato. Oh, we zoomed in, we zoomed in, I didn't realise. Oh, we've gone too far this time, too far. There we go, that's where we want to be. All right, we'll have a little bit of lettuce as well. There we go. Come on then, mate. Oh, off to your forever home. Oh, I'm going to miss him. Okay then, everybody, that's all the time I've got for today. We've overrun a little bit. I've still got more to do today, so I'm probably going to end up doing another little video. Um, so please like, subscribe, comment and share, ring the bell for me. If you want to watch another video, there should be one there. If you want to subscribe to the channel, it's up there. If you want to watch a playlist, no, if you want to, yeah, if you want to watch a playlist, it's up there. And don't forget, part two is going to be out tomorrow of me finishing everything off. So uh, very rare we do part ones and part twos, but we've got one today. So uh, I'll see you in the future. Bye.